Emojis, the language of emotion. With the strong dependency of effective communication on body language and the strong dependency of modern communication on electronics, emojis can help compensate for the shortcomings that come with the digital era. Emojis provide concrete digital records of the traditionally ambiguous universal language of emotion. In this video, we demonstrate how the way people use emojis mirrors that of language. For our research, we acquired collections of tweets containing emojis. When you tweet, the computer translates your words to a lower level representation called Unicode. Each emoji has its own unique Unicode representation, which we use to identify and extract emojis from tweets. In order to determine whether there is a structure to the way people use emojis, we created multiple complex networks that represents different ways to relate emojis to one another. We analyzed the distributions of these networks and used statistical tests to compare the structure of emojis across different tweet collections. We found that there is a consistent structure to the way people use emojis. Since we found a structure to emojis, we proceeded by comparing emojis to language. We used Heapslot, which is traditionally used to compare the structure of different languages. We applied Heapslot to our data, treating emojis as words. The results from Heapslot affirmed that the structure of emojis mirrors linguistics. Since we found that the structure of emoji usage is similar to language, we wanted to know whether people were actually using emojis to contribute to meaningful communication. The first way we approached this problem was by constructing a network that related emojis to the words they were frequently seen with. We did this by extracting the keywords from each tweet and then connecting keywords and emojis that occur together within the same tweet. The network was weighted by the frequency of a given word emoji pair. We then visualized the networks and identified two key relationships between words and emojis. Some emojis seemed to imply how people were feeling about the words they were used with. Other emojis appeared to connect to their semantic equivalent of word. To look further into the relationship between emojis as a means of emotional expression, we used a sentiment analysis to determine whether there is a correlation between the emojis used in a tweet and the sentiment of a tweet's text. We found that positive emojis, such as smiley faces, were associated with tweets of higher average sentiment. Since emojis can indicate someone's mood, we also wondered if emojis could indicate someone's circumstance. We used a temporal and geospatial analysis to define people's circumstances. We found that the popularity of different emojis varied throughout the day. We also found the emojis people were using reflect events occurring at a given location. The purpose of our project was to determine if the way people use emojis stimulates linguistic communication. We found that emojis have a consistent structure that is similar to language. We also found that emojis are related to the words they are used with by meaning and by sentiment, providing a strong argument that emojis have communicative properties. Finally, we showed how people use emojis to express their current situations through sentiment, temporal, and geospatial analyses. For the first time ever, people are speaking the same language. So let's try and see what they are saying.